Hi, my beautiful new era base. I don't know what to call you <clears throat> guys. Um, I just want to take a moment and really, really, really thank you for all the blessings that has been coming in uh, for me and my little boy. It's just beyond. Um, I haven't had time to just answer all. Just, I've read everything in the comment section uh, about the video, unless you don't know what this is about. The video where I sort of <laughs> had a little bit of a meltdown moment. Um, the the blessings that has been raining in, that was such a huge video for me and such a realization. I'll get to the realization there in a moment, what has been going on here. Um, two realizations actually. And so I just want to say, <clears throat> I was making that video, I thought I was just making the video like on a whim because I thought it was like my little, my little boy, Elliot, he just wanted to sort of talk in the microphone. Um, and even it wasn't even a reach out for anything really because it's just so beyond like what I'm capable of asking for it's just not in my DNA I shouldn't say that because now it is it really has shifted things for me and so me just saying stating the facts and then you guys like come in with so many like everything from just literally just blessings and then asking like you're probably 10 people <clears throat> right off the bat just came in saying can I please send you healing can we send you Reiki healing can we do this can we do that for you can you know can, how can I help how can I serve here uh to well wishes to money to money <laughs> like <laughs> like the the import of money I was like what is going on here I started to read the comment section I was just bawling I was just so it was just such a major shift for me to just be able to tell you guys how I feel and not be embarrassed about it or not feel ashamed about it because it's such a deep rooted thing that you know I should have it all together and for whatever reason I'm not human and should not get sick ever um, although there is a point to the sickness there so yeah i just i thank you thank you thank you thank you instead of answering like 100 comments i'll just do one big thank you here I, it you won't believe how it, this has shifted for me um that is my biggest lesson and that has been been a work in progress for sure for me over the years to be able to state how it is when it's not good and from that point even asking for help i mean i it, that I, I'm, I'm working on it. It's a work in progress. But I, you, you, just, you just don't know what you've done for me. And then I just have to say, um, <clears throat> I've started to do uh, this week. I'm back this week and started to do personal readings. And the energies that were in those personal readings, um, before my illness, I feel like I couldn't even have I couldn't have faced okay so and I want you to think about this in your own life if you ask for something and I love how Abraham uh, Esther Hicks that channels Abraham um, they're always saying well you can do it that quickly but we don't recommend it because it takes t it takes such a toll on the body so if you ask for like something major and you're not sort of there energetically to receive it rather than sort of bombard yourself to move yourself like almost like a explosion into being ready for something they always say like just one step at a time you know next logical step um whatever feels most comfortable um and this if it just felt like i think this is what they were talking about like it was like so i knew i was going to offer um you know, I had those readings that I actually had a, a, a couple of readings there to, to do before even going out with um, the Black Friday weekend offer. And, <clears throat> you know, the energy knows, the energy doesn't know any time. And so the energy knew already what types of questions that were going to come in. And I didn't think of it that way in the beginning. I was like, oh, this sickness just never ends. What is it? Like I'm so tired and then, and then at the same time, 
getting so much new information, which I usually don't, like if I'm, if I'm out, I'm out. Um, but this was like, it was like expanding me to, does that, does this make any sense? I needed to become ever so much more to be in vibration with the answers that you guys were seeking through your questions that I didn't even know was coming in. I, the only thing I knew was I wanted to do a Black Friday offer. I wanted to give back to you guys in, in some capacity. And that was before getting sick. I even, like that was a plan long ago. And I needed to upgrade myself to a place energetically where I could just be more in the level of the answers that you were seeking. It's your fault that I'm sick <laughs> or was sick. Um, just really kidding. So am I a person who likes it to like go slow and steady wins the race type of stuff? Maybe sometimes I sort of like to be in control. I don't like when I'm put outside of a comfort zone. It really messes me up. Um, but I'm so impatient at the same time. I'm a Leo and I'm just, there's a Leo Virgo Libra mix in there. And it's, uh, I, I'm, I'm not patient whatsoever. So would I rather do this month of just an upgrade out of the out of this world uh, rather than maybe probably six months that it would need that I would have needed, but maybe a little bit more calm, like health wise? I probably take the month. It's crazy, but I probably take the month. And then my little co co pilot, Elliot, who's sort of like we're sort of joined at the hip. So whatever he does, I do, and whatever I do, he does, and so. This poor little man, <laughs> he's, he's done everything under the sun when it came. Like we ended, we ended the last thing with the chicken pox. So he ended up getting chicken pox. I thought like we're back on track. I'm going to start like that was next week. Like I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start this week. And then he got chicken pox. And I was like, for the love of what is going on here? Um, but he, he came really mild and I was like, yeah. You better, you better not mess with him and start like this whole, whole other thing for him. Like he, he's, he's ha had his run. If he's going to get chicken poxes on top of this, like you better be kind. And it was, it was a very kind virus to him. I think I heard him one say, mom, it's itching. Like it's, it's a little bit itchy on my leg. And that was it. And, and he still had like, she, like all over his body, but that was it. So <clears throat> I just want to say that this, you guys, and like we're in this together forever, uh, maybe not forever, it's a little bit over exaggerating, but just, I just want to, I want you to know there's so much more going on and maybe in your life as well. Like you, maybe you have felt sick. Maybe you have felt really tired and fatigued and just haven't really been able to, or, or having like sleep <clears throat> deprivation, you're out flying it, flying around everywhere in your in your sleep state. You might be all over your place and maybe almost have like amnesia. Like I just find right now there's no room to <laughs> it's like there's no room to store any memory. I don't know how to explain it otherwise. It's like if I don't address something in the moment that I'm doing it, it's gone. It's like I was like that. It, I can, just the other day, I just had this call to my mother. I had three things to say to her and pro probably very important things. I can't say any, like, if it's important, it's, it'll come back. No, it doesn't. I have to write it down in the moment. And there's something about, like, there's only room for what happens in the present moment. And when it's gone, it's gone. Unless you need it for the next present moment, it's not going to be there. And so, and that's not you going crazy. That's just you being sort of forced into be very, very present in the moment, right this minute. Because we're called to be that, okay? There's probably crazy things going on for you. And I think that we're interconnected in a way deeper way than I realized. The two realizations that I said. One is that the... The realization is not so much that I understand that I need to ask for help every once in a while, because I've known that before, but you guys backing me up without me sort of not even asking, there's so much healing in that, I can't even explain it. Um, I felt like I've done everything on my own, like 
my entire life and or like I'm on my like I, I'm I if, if this is going to be sorted out I have to sort it out myself um and and the second thing I'm expanding energy wise to the place where I'm becoming the answer that you're seeking to your questions and that might not even be just only for the personal readings it might be um also just here just asking you have you have your askings as you come and listen to these videos and I just really encourage you to ask even stronger because spirit like source is going to start to bring those answers through to you even in the general reads and so if you have like questions ask them and and see what comes through here in the channel okay that was 10 minutes of sort of literally just saying one thing or two things but I just really wanted to take this moment and just say it's a you you guys are literally a blessing you're not gonna get rid of me now <laughs> I'm gonna ask for everything um you hear in my voice still you hear in my in my nose still I see it in my eyes still that I like it, it looks like I'm not fully fully back but um uh I used to say it's a blessing and a curse because I can't fully do a reading which sucks if I'm not fully back energetically because I won't get clear messages uh, if I will get messages, it's sort of like a struggle. It's really tough to, it's, it's just not enjoyable whatsoever. Um, and the blessing is I have to get really, really clear to get the messages. And so it's like, it's, I sort of have to stay on top of things constantly to do my job or it doesn't work. And that is, that is just really beautiful. Although sometimes I wish I could do a little something when you're not fully back, but you're sort of quite okay to to start doing things, but that is not the like. Then I would have to do a different type of job. So, thank you so much, guys. I am forever grateful, thankful. Um, Elliot for sure as well, my little master teacher. Um, thank you, really from the bottom of my heart. It it really is a blessing to have you guys out there. I feel I feel held by so many of you it's it's unreal i'm gonna get gonna get emotional again okay i'm gonna go <clears throat> and get on with uh readings for the this for the december oh, i can't talk now for the month of december okay guys bye <laughs>